Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to use Bunch app. So this app, uh, it does what it says, this is group, video chat and party games. Uh, that's the name of the app, that's what you're going to be able to do within the app. And in this video I'm going to be uh, kind of doing like an overview of how to do absolutely everything within the app. So hopefully I cover everything in this video. So first of all, we're going to start off with like uh, just uh, signing up the different options you can do with like creating an account for a uh, bunch of apps. So first of all, you've got different options here. You can see continue with Apple, you can continue with Snapchat. You also click more options. So you can continue with like your SMS, uh, Facebook, uh, all that type of stuff as well. So it depends uh, what you want to sign up with there. Do whatever option you want to. So I'm going to click continue with Snapchat because if you do that, uh, then uh, you're going to be able to like, use your Bitmoji etc with this so as you can see here you're connected to a bunch already it says it will use your display name and Bitmoji avatar you can continue with that I think that's the best way of doing it personally if you're going to sign up so you use your Bitmoji etc like potentially within the app and you can do other types of things like that I think it's much easier it says that you can have post notifications on you don't have to do that you can click skip at the top or turn it on if you do want to uh, for this uh, but as you can see here this is going to be like the home page uh, there's two different things at the bottom there you got the friends page and the games page uh, that's going to like show your games etc uh, first of all uh, we'll like get into uh, like the right hand side of this screen uh, so these different games here you can see um, they've got some games that are like initially up on the app um, in general, like Mars Dash, Draw Party, Hoops, Pool, Trivia, Flappy Lives, guess what? And then you can also have like other games that are on your phone. Like for instance, on my phone, I do have Roblox. I uh, have Call of Duty as well, Call of Duty Mobile. Uh, so both of them games there, you can actually like download on your phone. As you can see, I've got them on my phone here. Uh, Call of Duty there and Roblox at the top there. You can see them. That is on the phone that I've downloaded. Nothing to do with this app, but you can actually use it within the app. So that's pretty cool. So you can download apps like random ones. I'm not sure if it's absolutely every app, but... Uh, you can like see if you could download it and then you'll be able to play it with friends etc like they'll uh, see your reactions in the call etc like that so that's pretty cool uh, to do that so uh, these were all the games so first of all uh, I'm going to go on the friends side just to kind of do the tutorial of this I'm going to start off on the top left hand corner uh, where you can click on that the little picture you have like, your profile picture there uh, there you see your name etc you can click edit info uh, for that and then this is where you'll be able to change your username, your first name, and your last name. So when you initially sign up, you'll be asked for these things, but you can change them uh, whenever you want this, as many times as you want to, within here as well. If it's ticked, then you know that the name is allowed to. If it's not, you're going to have to change it. So that's where you change the name and the stuff here, just by clicking on it and then saving it, etc. And you can back out of that at the top left. And here is where you can add friends. So you've got multiple different options of adding friends here. You've got iMessage, then copy the link to like link, like an email, or whatever. You can share the link, uh, WhatsApp. Uh, Snapchat, Facebook, Messenger, all this types of stuff. You can connect there, uh, find new friends in your address book as well. So there's plenty of different ways of like adding friends, etc. This is the way uh, the page to do it on here. Then you've got settings. You can click on that, and then this is the notifications. So it says here automatically notify my friends when I open bunch. If you don't want that, which that could potentially be annoying, you can click on that, and then say I'm sure. Whatever I'm sure your friends might miss you next time you're on. You can click on I'm sure, and then it will go back to purple. Uh, also from purple to white I should say and then you can go the notify me when friends are opening bunch you can click on that if you want to that's if they have that initial one open and you can also send feedback if you want as well you can shake to send feedback click that on if you want to so those are the settings you can leave a review by clicking there that's what you want you can chat with us and that just brings them like a, like a Facebook messenger thing which you're going to send them uh, like issues or like uh, potentially uh, like different suggestions uh, you can report a problem here I uh, say, are you enjoying Bunch? Uh, they say, yes, yeah, cool, whatever. Here's like, the links like their Twitter, Instagram, Messenger, etc. You can share the Bunch. Then this is where you log out to. So you're going to have to go to this page and go to the bottom to log out there. Uh, so that's everything for that uh, feature there. Then next, uh, we've got um, at the top right, you can just add friends like that. It's probably the easiest, quickest way to do it. You can find Facebook friends. Uh, then also uh, all these different contacts that you share, link, etc. But... The next uh, big thing is like with like a friend. Once you added the friend there by like uh, clicking on that, you can also like type in section their name. Like for instance, that's how I added uh, like my friend right here. So you can see there you've got that. You can click on that person's uh, name, and then you can like say hi to them, etc. On the top right here, you've got like unfriend or report if you want to do that there. That's how to do that. You can say hi just by clicking on that. 
and then it comes it comes up on their phone like saying hi and then we had to like see that etc they can also ask them to, like let's play uh, like specific games you've got all these types of games you can play here uh, where it, you could potentially play like see the other people playing games with the ones that they haven't got etc so for instance on my friend's phone they don't have call of duty mobile so you won't be able to see it here but if you do you could be able to like see it in call etc and then play together but uh right now you, you don't uh, on this like kind of option right here but you do have all these games you can play with your friends that should be okay to use so you can click let's play on them if you want to and you can also click the hide just by clicking that to the right hand side as well and they'll see it too so and next uh, on this thing this is these games here so you do have master astral party hoops pool trivia flappy lives guess what so you can kind of click on them uh, for instance master Ash is like a trending one uh, that you'll be able to use that there so i'm going to click on that and once you see that, you'll be able to see uh, your little uh, on the uh, you're able to click on your um, well, actually you should be able to see I should say like your little picture in like the top left hand corner of the screen uh, right there. And uh, see so if you want to like remove that etc. You can click the settings in the bottom left hand corner. And be able to turn the camera off here, so you'll be able to see that like, you've got, like the profile picture or whatever. You just like turn the camera around if you've got the camera on. You can just turn it around if I see the other side etc. As you can see. Uh, then you can uh, turn the camera off, turn the uh, mic off, and then you can also turn the headphones off as well right there. And you can just click them on. When it's red, they're off. Uh, when uh, it's uh, not red, then you know it's on. So down there with the settings and the cog at the bottom left-hand corner to do all of those things. Then uh, if you want to uh, like go into like a mini player, you can just click on that. And then you can like see that in a mini, and then you can go to other games, etc., other places within the app. That's how you do that. Then you can click back on it again to go back onto the screen. And uh, then in the bottom right hand corner, you can like pick a new game, end the game, etc. If you don't want to go on this one, you like click the wrong one. Then you can also like, end um, on the top left, but that's more like uh, if you're you can like leave the party. That's more if you're with in, in with someone. But now after like add a friend or like invite them, you want to click on their like their name potentially. You can also message them. Let's say uh, normal like messaging, etc. You got like emojis and stuff like that. Uh, so you got that, and then they can also uh, when you're in the games. Uh, the best thing I think is to click the game, which what you what you want to do. So we'll just go with uh, um, like Mars Dash with this one. Then you can go ahead and click Invite Friends, and then uh, what you want to do is like see the friend's name there. Click Invite for that. It will come up on their screen. They just have to it will like, automatically come up if they're on the app, and then it'll best be able to join the game like that. Okay, so once they've accepted it, this is what you're going to see on the screen. Uh, what you're going to want to do, uh, both of you, is click I'm ready. So once both of you have uh, clicked I'm ready, then you will be able to like go into the game. And then also while you're doing this, you can click on the top right hand corner within the game. And then you'll see the little three little dots. Then you'll say disable microphone, disable speaker, enable camera, submit a bug. You can do all that within there. And then you'll see that the game starts. So we'll just do like an example game of like just to show how it does, etc. Like this. So you can see that here's like the, the trending game, the most uh, popular one within the app uh, so all these things you can see how it does you got fall there then it goes back up etc like this it will just go through this game this is actually a pretty fun game let me go in there and then just do uh play this one out just to show you what it's like at the end etc i'm not very good this is uh, one of the first times i've used this i've just done it uh, uh, two other times before so you sort of like jump to the next levels etc so then you will be able to see like your your like uh, friends uh, like a video at the top like the video cameras turned off for both of us right now but you'll be able to see like their reactions etc the top screen where you see the little uh, profile avatars etc so that will be there for them to see uh, while this is happening and also it'll be like a similar feature within other games like potentially if you're doing like the call of duty or roblox or whatever other game you're downloading on both your phones it'll be the similar type of process with that as you're seeing on screen now so we're going towards the end of this game you're gonna go in there as it's finished, and then that's how it like that's like one of the games finished here. Once it's done, uh, you'll be able to see like your friend. You see at the bottom there, or at the bottom where it says see how, how far they're going within the app. You see that person right behind next. I'm not actually controlling it, but uh, once the games gets to ended here, we'll wait and go through. So you can click X on this as well uh, to like leave the room in the top left hand corner or end this game right this right here. So I'm just gonna like leave this room for instance or end the game. So I click end the game. And then, as you can see here, this is what will come up on screen if both your like video cameras are here uh, when you're in the game. So you can be able to see the video cameras, or if you've not got it on, you'll be able to see that it's off, etc. On the top right, it will kind of like minimize it yet again. And you can also add more friends at the bottom right-hand corner, 
And then at the top left hand corner, that is how you're going to end the call if you don't want to continue on. And you just leave the party and then that, that call will be ended, etc. So you've got all these different games right here. I can go through and do all of them. If you want me to do any more, uh, like showing you how to play each of the games, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, but for all of these things here, is uh, anything else that you do want to know, leave it in the comments. But this should be it for this video. Hopefully everything made sense. If you're going to go out and use this app, leave a like on the video. Subscribe for more videos like this. Click on screen to see my how-to videos, an app similar to this. But that's it for now. I'll see you in the next video.